Hey guys and welcome to the bevel tutorial for Blender. Beveling is a very important tool for 3D modeling because it allows you to keep the realism in your hard edges because in real life no edge is perfectly sharp like it is in the flat shaded cube that we have here for example. Because no edge is perfectly sharp, most of the time you're going to want to bevel it in some way if you want to keep those edges hard but realistic. So let me just show you what beveling is. This is beveling. This is a beveled cube. As you can see here, the edges are sort of rounded off just a little bit, but in a way where everything still makes sense. So it doesn't add that much geometry, but it does allow for these edges here to look a little bit more natural, a little bit more realistic. In the real world, you might see a die, for example, uh, a rolling die, and uh, it would look a little bit more like this than it would like this, for example. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I got to this. There's two ways to do it. Uh, one way is through the bevel modifier. So that's actually what I have applied right now. If we go to the modifiers tab, you can see I have here, let me go ahead and drag this out. I have this bevel modifier here. So you can see that there's a couple things you can tinker around with. For example, the width parameter of the modifier. And you can see it gets a little bit rounder with a larger number and a little bit sharper with a smaller number. You might want to go for a little bit sharper if you want the edge to be just a little bit harder. So there is some settings you can play around with that. Uh, you can also do segments which allows for an even rounder edge as you can see here it rounds it off just a little bit better. And beveling actually goes really well with a smooth shading. So you can see now it looks very natural. It's very smooth around the faces but the edges still remain rather hard but rounded. So you can get a more realistic shading with the smooth shading and the beveling gives a nice little touch to it. Now there's a few more advanced settings you can play around with here so you can have fun with that see what everything does. Now there is another way to bevel and that is in edit mode. So I can go ahead and hit tab to go into edit mode and then hit W to open up a specials menu. This has a lot of very handy features and tools that can be used during modeling. And you'll notice there's a tool named bevel and of course this is basically the same thing as the modifier but now in edit mode so you're manipulating the vertices directly. So I'm gonna go ahead and press this bevel option or I can press B and then I can as you can see here drag outwards and as long as I have the entire cube selected it will bevel every edge. Now it'll only bevel what edges you have selected, so make sure you keep that in mind. And I'm going to go ahead and left click to confirm, or right click to cancel. Now if you right click, nothing happens, nothing crazy happens, it's all back to normal. And if I select everything again, hit W and then B, drag out, and then left click, voila, there we have it. So that is a beveled cube in edit mode. As you can see here, it is completely beveled and baked into the geometry. So that is how you bevel an object in Blender.